Boydy Nerdigans, this is the one and only Packer Girl 89 and today's Manga Nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for Gintama chapter 650 and wow, last chapter we finished the space portion of the final arc and wow, the death of Nobu Nobu man, that was, that was so freaking good. Like, just the way Nobu Nobu went out. It wasn't as, like, awesome as Bonsai, but it was just, it was amazing. It was really cool. Anyway, now we're back on Earth, and we get to see Gintoki! Finally! I'm so stoked! Anyway, let's get to this, let's get to this chapter and see what happens next. What's with those faces? You guys lose something? Oh, don't tell me the thing you're looking for. Is Big Bro Jin here? Go, Gobbly! He's Gobbly and Kentucky right off the bat! Oh my god! Oh my god! I missed him! I I know we saw them like briefly last chapter, but god! Oh my god! Or is it your actual Big Bro that's bright red from all the blood on him? <laughs> I love Gobbly! I'm just screwing with ya. Um. Uh, and this chapter is titled, Be Careful You Don't Drink Too, uh, too Much Dom Pere Yon. And, uh, and it says here, After the Fierce Battle. Oh my god. Jinchan, Kamui, thank goodness I knew you were still alive. You, did you save? And what if I did? Would that change your opinion of your big brother at all? I would hope you wouldn't underrate me so much. Oh, here we go. We're... We're seeing what happened. We're fun. We're seeing what happened. Thank God. I'd hope you wouldn't underrate me so much. Uh, the um, that Utsuru guy took my prey, um, Umibuzu, from me once. I've got a debt uh, to repay. I just wanted to make him feel what I felt. Uh, you were just wait. Uh, you were just trying to kill him before Utsuru could get to him, weren't you? <laughs> I think getting hit by uh, the out of control Altana might have been the more um, the more pleasant experience. <laughs> if I were being serious, you'd be dead. <laughs> oh, God, like... Yeah, well, if I weren't serious, you'd be dead. <laughs> I love this manga. Well, if you learn your lesson here, I'm hoping you'll act a little more uh, prudently in the future. I don't feel like losing anymore. And if we uh, lose a military asset like like you, we won't be able to win against against that thing. Kamui, Kamui, sheesh. You're getting lectured by a wild boar to keep a cool head. You must be really losing your touch, boss. Okita! 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 Oh my god! Okita's okay! Thank... Thank god! Thank Kamui! Thank, or not thank Kamui, fuck. Thank Kami! Thank Arceus! Thank Jesus! He's alive! Oh my god, I was so scared! He's, he, but he's got a point. Whenever that thing's in front of you... Oh, I love Kansai Ben. Thank you, God. Thank God for Kansai Ben. Whenever that thing's in front of you, you lose track of everything else around you. And if you do that, then the wild boar can't uh, get its kicks to land. Are you saying you could dodge that wild boar's kicks? Sorry, but I'm not the type to get uh, riled up from cheap provocations like boars are. Besides, we can't afford to lose the precious military asset that is our boar. <laughs> I love this writing. Don't worry, I can fill a military deficit your size on my own. <laughs> God, my... Like... I swear to God, like, the best... I love Kamui. I love Kitoki, and I fucking love Okina. Like... This is just coming to gold right here. Oh, that's a pretty big talk. Hey, knock it off. We we are all stick. Wait, sorry. Hey, knock it off. We are all sick of that Vegeta and Piccolo back and forth. Yes. <laughs> oh my God, the Dragon Ball reference. We got a Dragon Ball reference. <laughs> Um, let's, I don't know who would be the Vegeta and who would be the Piccolo. Oh, y you know what? <laughs> no, I'm, like, I'm trying to think who would be the Vegeta and who would be the Piccolo here. No, I know who would be, no, Kamui is flat out 
the uh, uh, Kamui is Vegeta. Period. I'm sorry. Uh, Kamui is is flat out Vegeta. Okay. Uh, Okita, yeah, yeah. I would, kind of, I would say Okita is Piccolo in this situation. Yeah. Okita is definitely Piccolo in this situation. Let's make this simple. You, uh, your little si your little sister's ugly. So is yours. <laughs> What kind of reference is that? Uh, is that correct? <laughs> this chapter is amazing. I'm not. How many? I'm only four pages in, and I'm just dying. This chapter is amazing. Um, jeez, what a bunch of weirdos I've gotten in debt with. <laughs> well, whatever it takes. As long as we survive this whole ordeal, we, we should be fine. What about the others? I don't know, but all of Edda looks like this. Just how many victims have been made at this point? Wait. Uh, just how many victims have been made at this point? Oh, wait. I fucking read this wrong. Hold on. What about the others? Just how many victims have been made at this point? I don't know, but all of Edda looks like this. The damages aren't limited to humans. Gengai-san, um, are you... Gengai-san, you're okay. Like hell I am. When these guys came, um... Uh, they started treating me like I was a thing uh, to be haul hauled around. Sorry about that. I just heard that on this planet, if something's useless, you can call it a person or a, th or a thing or a hunk of junk. Gengai! Gengai's live! Oh my god, Gengai! Oh my god! Then drill this into your, into your thick... Uh, then drill this in... Uh, into your skulls on this planet the metals that get uh get sent to the ones that um that have finished uh their duties are uh, and burn themselves out are what we called hunk <laughs> what we call hunts of junk finish their duties yeah uh the nanomachine virus that this old geezer scattered uh, all throughout edo all seem to have died out uh, died off the bees the bees um uh specialize in disabling me mechanical weapons so they they're pretty, um, unequipped to, um, handle attacks. All that stuff that happened before wasn't from a machine, so it ended up blowing them all to bits. So the bees are done. All the bees are gone. They're dead. Then right now, Edo is completely defenseless. Oh, fuck. The Liberation Army's, uh, fleet... If the Liberation Army's fleet were to attack now, we'd have no means to, of stopping them. Well, that's not a problem now. We're That's all taken care of. D damn it. All we've struggled uh, so hard to protect all this time. That man overturned it all in an instant. That... Oh, it's true. That asshole. I swear to God. I fucking hate Utsuru. Utsuru is... I, 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 I gotta give Utsuru props, though. Utsuru is just a beast. He is a fucking beast. Hold on a second. Lost my spot. Hold on. Where are you? Protect? You mean that huge pile of junk? Looking at this, uh, at all this rubble, this country's, a country's turned into, I don't, I don't know who'd call it protected. <laughs> Looks more like who won and who's lost got settled a long time ago. And maybe the only people that haven't acknowledged that are the people right around here. <clears throat> no, <clears throat> excuse me. No, there are people like that here too. Up above your heads, way up in space. There's no need to, um pay any attention to anything uh going up up here we've got we've got it all taken care of yeah i'm glad that that is getting acknowledged <coughs> i'm excuse me i'm glad that that's gotten take uh, that's getting um acknowledged and that they're communicating about that thank god this chapter man this chapter is just freaking amazing i fucking love this chapter we're only seven chapters in and i'm just laughing my ass off already Ginto, uh, hold on a second. Let me just do this. Let me read this part, of, um, the sentence again. 
there's uh, no need to pay any mind to anything going um, going on up here. We've got it all taken care of, Gintoki. <gasps> Shinsuke! He's alive! Oh, thank God! I, I told you, I've been say, or I should say, I've been telling you guys that Shinsuke is going to play a part in this final battle against Utsuru. Shinsuke, I, I, I'm telling you, Shinsuke is going to die. I hate that he's going to die, but he is going to die, and he's going to die against Utsuru. Utsuru is going to kill him. I, um, next, it's your turn. What? No, Shinsuke, you need to get your ass down here. You better be getting your ass down here, because you need to be, you need to get your ass healed, get your ass down here, and play a part in this fight. The Yellow Dragon Maidens and the God Dog Inugami. Uh, they put the dragon veins uh, to sleep, the ones which have protected the dragon veins since ancient times. Yeah. Um, the Ginariki. Um, a Ginariki is basically a phrase in the uh, Shu, uh, Gendu, Gendu, ah, Shugendao religion, meaning the ability to bring about a miracle. Here we go. Let's see what they're doing. At times, it awaits the dragon vein and activates the torrent. And at times, the Ginariki... Whoa, what are they doing? Soothes an unruly dragon and quiets that torrent. In the shadows of history, the ones that fought, have fought those dragons and brought about uh, peace and balance to this land. The clan that has conquered the dragon, that is. Ooh. I'm liking what... Yeah, yeah, the cabaret uh, club shrine uh, made in um, Inchon, right? It's been a while. Sorry, thanks for... Um, the call and everything but i don't think i'll have um time to pop into the club today the words just got uh the world's just a little on the verge of destruction right now and i just can't pull myself away yeah and on top of that uh the princess is off somewhere looking for a dog um this old man man's really beat ah uh, that's okay no prob i just want to hear your voice a bit mm, okay well I'll talk to you later are you kidding me old man who the hell would make a cabaret club sales call at a time like this? Don't you listen to the people when they talk? Didn't you hear? Oh my god! Oh my god! Don't you listen to people when they talk? Didn't you hear what our backstory is? I told you we're fighting all out to protect Edo right now. Fucking god damn it! This is so. This is classic in Tama, like at its finest. Hey, I'm listening. I knew without you even saying anything basically you just uh want me to keep quiet at, at uh the club that you're running a second job of protecting the world alongside being a cabaret club girl get your mind off the cabaret th club thing old man okay now please listen on our clan's name we're going to make sure we quiet down all of the places where the dragon veins are going crazy but that alone won't get them back under control oh here we go this is this is important stuff somebody is operating the gate that controls the dragon hole deep under the terminal to act however they please. We know who that is. That's Utsuru. Utsuru's doing this shit. Well, we're getting things under control up here on the surface. Uh, um, Papa, you and the others need to attack that underground basement and get them under control. If you can do that, then we can definitely get Edo back to normal. Ainchan, please let us work with you. The reason all this happened in the first place was because our clan couldn't protect the dragon hole from the, um, Amato. We want to get it back. The thing we lost back then. But do you have enough military forces left to do that? Yeah, we might not. But compared to treating you to the, to Dom Perry... Where? I see what you did there, manga! But compared to treating you to Dom Perry, Perry Nyan, at um the victory party I'll, it'll be a lot easier on uh, my bank book <laughs> i get ya <clears throat> i think i've got a, a good picture of the situation over there i don't know who these guys are but they sure did a good job coming in from outer space to wipe our asses for us still we didn't need that help sure sure um sure this country doesn't exactly look the way it used to from an onlooker's perspective it might just look like a mountain of junk but while this country may be burning, not one person here has uh, burned out yet. They ain't turned into hunks, uh, hunks of junk yet. The things we're trying to protect haven't been hurt at all, so it might be too early to uh, be hand handing out medals. <clears throat> How about your end? You may have stopped the, uh, the Liberation Army, but 
I'll bet that hasn't been enough to burn burn you guys out, right? No way you guys have been reduced to hunks of junk, right? Aw. Yeah. You better be ready for when I come for you. coming and he, I'm telling you he is going to die during he's gonna get killed by Utsuru he is he's gonna get killed by Utsuru I'm calling this now or fuck I called it a while ago that he's gonna get killed by Utsuru uh sister something seems off with uh Kamaku it's as I suspected it was too much of a burden to give to just one I wonder how much longer she'll last with uh last both Kamaku and us if only that child were here sister that child is walking a different path from ours. We couldn't have get, uh, couldn't have him suddenly come back and carry the fate of the clan on their back. We Sadaharu! Sadaharu is coming here. Do you not care what happens uh, to Kamaku then, Mo? Kamaku, Kamaku, the the how? You're late. Sadaharu is gonna come save the day now. Cause he's some Sadaharu now. This is where Sa Sadaharu is going to um, play a role now here. And I love it. I love that. I love, this is what, something that I love about this arc of Gintama. Is that every character is playing a role in saving Edo. Even minor characters are playing a role. And, Sa and now Sadaharu is coming. Sadaharu is going to help his peoples and do it. And I fuck up his clan. I fucking love it. I love it. Yo, you're late. <laughs> we found a way to stop those dragon veins. But you'd better hurry. The dog disappeared. That rings a bell or two with you, right? One. The god children for protecting the dragon hole have assembled. Yeah! This chapter was awesome. This was a great chapter to set up. Because um, this, this is the final portion of the final arc, if you think about it. Because we have the space portion of the arc, and now we have the earth portion of the, of, um, of the final arc. And this was a great chapter to set it up. First of all, this shit was... The beginning of this chapter was just funny as hell. I fucking loved it. This is just classic Itama. Uh, I, I love... And we know where we're going. We know where we're heading to. I don't know... Like... We're obviously going to be having... It's not going to be just like flat out... Like we're going to go straight to fighting Utsuru. No, there's, there's going to be a catch. There's gonna be, there's gotta be some, Utsuru's got, Utsuru has plans lined up for them. It's not just flat out fighting Utsuru. That's my gut feeling. We're gonna, Utsuru's gonna have some minions waiting for us. And, um, Shinsuke said, and as Shinsuke said, he's coming. He's gonna, uh, uh, Shinsuke's gonna be there. He's gonna show up some point when we're fighting Utsuru. So, that's when he'll show, he'll show up, uh, at some point during that portion of, of this arc but i'm really i'm really hyped i love how, that sataharo is playing a big uh, is playing a role with the veins um i love that we got and we got the clan there we got the shin Sugumi together um I, i'm curious how we're gonna divide stuff uh, like i'm curious how uh, like we have like the overall plan i'm curious how things are gonna be divided up within like the Shin Sugumi. Like obviously we're gonna have um Okita uh we're gonna have um Gintoki. Okita is not is has to go with Gintoki. Like he just has to. Um it's gonna be Okita, Gintoki, Kamui, um, Kagura, and um uh 
and Shibachi, uh, and uh, Shibachi, they are all going to be together, period. And they're going to, they're going to go toward, they're going to be going towards Utsuru. That's what they're doing. And then Kamui's crew is going to be off doing something else. And, like, it's going to be interesting. Next chapter, we'll find out how, like, everything else is going to be divided. But I'm very curious what you guys uh, thought of this chapter. How do you guys think everything's going to be be divided? And um, do you guys agree with me that Shinsuke, not only is Shinsuke going to come down here, but he do you guys think that Shinsuke is going to die by Utsuru's hand? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdigans Inc. And if you love what I'm doing and want to contribute to my channel expansion, there's a few ways you could do that. You could donate to my PayPal, Patreon, or purchase something off my Amazon wishlist. All those links are in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow me on Twitter. Follow my Twitch channel, friend me on PlayStation Network. All that's in the description box below as well. Till next time, Nerdigans, I'll be seeing you later.